Hey Pisces, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to rope. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's your girl Keonti and I'm going to bring us a reading. Could be about love, could be about career, could be about family, could be about anything. But it will be for the baby sharks, the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are cross-watching this video for Pisces, it could resonate from your perspective. Meaning, I could be saying someone is doing something to the Pisces and it could actually be the Pisces doing this to you. Just put it where it goes, okay? They are general messages, so everything I say won't resonate for you. Please use your discernment and keep what resonates for you and release what doesn't, all right? I do offer private readings and if you guys are interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information will be provided in the description box below along with the link to my Etsy shop for $10 personalized messages. Please keep in mind the $10 personalized Etsy messages. They have a 48 to 72 hour turnaround time. You will not get that read immediately after you send the $10. Please and thank you. All right, Pisces. Let's see what we got going on here. Spirit, what's going on in the messages of the in the life of the baby shark spirit? Give me messages for the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and the Cross Watcher. Don't leave anyone out, spirit. Stalking, watching, obsessed. So you have someone watching, or you ooh, whatever someone's watching is stressing them out, Pisces. So I have the stalker. This is stalking, watching, obsessed. It could be a Capricorn watching you. You watching a Capricorn. But there's definitely someone that's paying close attention. And whatever it is that they're watching, it is giving them high anxiety. This is nightmares, insomnia, paranoia, anxiety, unable to sleep, seeing things, under eye bags, right? So whatever someone is watching here, Pisces, whether this is someone watching you or you watching someone, this is... I'm paying very close attention, and whatever it is I'm paying very close attention to, it is stressing me out, okay? Someone could watch you at night, stalk you at night, watch your profile at night or something like that. Okay, give me more for the baby sharks. What else we got going on here? What else do we got going on here? For Pisces, spirit, make it plain. Pisces, this could be you kind of obsessed with something and stressing out. It doesn't have to be in, like a, a person, but there's someone that is definitely fixated. Right? Whatever it is that they're fixated on, whether this is you or someone, whatever they're fixated on is stressing them out. Head in the clouds. See, this is a lot of thought. You could be dealing with an air sign because this feels like very airy, very thought, right? Very thought um, based, right? This is someone in their head. It literally says in their heads, right? And what's under here? Love triangle, third party, multiple choice, multiple lovers' choices. You could be dealing with a Gemini. Pisces, someone could kind of be keeping their eye on you and have their head in the clouds. And this person could be imagining whether this is really happening or it, or not. Someone is imagining that someone has multiple choices, multiple options, multiple lovers here. Pisces, you could be watching someone thinking this, right? I do see this energy of kind of being obsessed. It feels like with the head in the clouds, someone is wondering, right? They're wondering. And someone's imagination could be getting away from them. This is why they're having, they're, they're having this high anxiety, right? It was just my imagination running away with me. Yeah, somebody's imagination could be running away with them about a situation, it, like for sure. Pisces, some of you have someone that is fixated on you. They're fantasizing about you. They definitely, like, they want a piece of you. Hmm. Give me, give me one more for the Pisces spirit. Give me one, 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 one more. Put yourself where you go in this, baby sharks, because you could be doing this or someone is doing this to you. Give me one more for the Pisces. Dust it off. Dust yourself off and try again. Pick yourself up of acting cold. Ooh wee. Okay. Some of you are definitely dealing with an air sign. I feel it strongly because acting cold is an air energy for me too. But let's go ahead and get into it. Pisces. Rather, th maybe this person is having a hard time dusting their self off and moving on from you, right? Maybe you maybe you dusted yourself off and moved on because this is the energy of dusting yourself off, picking yourself back up, and going forward. Now I have acting cold here. Ooh we I heard no love to give. Pisces. Someone I, this this is for me, this is speaking something, right? The 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 I there is an ice cube in her mouth, right? Speaking some cold shit, right? Talking very coldly. But the ice cube is shaped like a heart. Could be a definite energy of no love lost. Ooh, under there is broke ass and fed up. So who, 
Ooh, Pisces. Ooh, and there's a false daddy under here. Ooh, baby sharks. We're going to clarify. Let me show you what I'm seeing here, Pisces. I have this cold energy. Someone acting cold, possibly being very detached, right? And under that was broke ass. So it's like no nothing to give to it, right? No love to give, no money to give, no energy to give, nothing, right? And then under here is fed up. Don't, don't want to hear some shit anymore. Pisces, you have to put yourself where you go in this. Because this is the energy, and under here is a boss daddy, an, an emperor energy, feeling very threatened by this, right? Maybe someone is obsessed because they get, they can't get you to give give to something here. Someone is acting very unemotionally. They're not giving anything to a situation, and they're also fed up with hearing about a situation here. Pisces, either with boss daddy and threatened here, someone this emperor energy is feeling very threatened by this attitude or this emperor's energy is feeling, this emperor, emperor, sorry, this emperor energy is feeling this way about a situation here. We're going to do some more clarification, but I see what's happening. I just don't know where you go in it, Pisces. What, what part do you play? You could be the stalker or someone could be, <laughs> you could be the one kind of obsessed stressed out about this or this could be someone feeling this way about you i do see clearly that someone is being very cold being very detached if they're speaking they're very cold and detached about what they're saying with broke ass they could literally be telling someone no they don't want they they're not giving someone any money or they don't want to hear anyone asking for money but i also feel like they're not giving energy they're not going to give anything to this situation because they don't want to hear something they're fed up here like i said pisces this may not even be you this may not even be you. Just put yourself where you go in it. Let me do some clarification for you guys. Guys, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share if I'm getting it right for you. Make sure that you email me if you're interested in booking me for a private reading. Give me one for stalker. Sold. Moving. Physical change. Location. Pisces, perhaps you moved on from this person and they're stalking. Somebody could be stressed out waiting to move because they're, this is cancerian energy for me too. Be dealing with a cancer. So far, I have cancer, Capricorn. Um, I have lots of air. Aries, Taurus here. Lots of air again. Some of you are stressed out about a move. You're stressed. You're, you're stressed out. You're watching and waiting. Some of you could be obsessed with the with the house that you want. You're ready to move, right? But if this is about love, ooh, we forbidden love. See, I feel like there's an energy of someone kind of like on the outside looking in. Someone could have literally moved or moved on, right? This is, this is, this is, I'm done, right? I can't stand to look at this shit anymore, right? Tragedy, right? Let me see what this, let's see, let's see what this head in the cloud energy is about. What's this head in the cloud energy? Someone is sitting back thinking about something intently here. Anxiety, I told you, we already had this, but this is for damn sure clarifying it. Anxiety, scared, panic. Someone is having very, it's like their mind is racing. Someone's mind is racing. They're fixated. Hamster wheel, surviving the daily hustle. That's earth energy for me, but there could definitely be an energy. Listen, Pisces, someone could be kind of obsessed with you, right? You could have moved on. You could have, you could definitely be um, focusing on yourself and your, your finances and your stability. And it's making someone very afraid. Someone very panicky, right? Because they could literally, they could be fixated on you. Because they literally feel like you dusted yourself off. And you moved on and you're fed up with them. Right? If that's not it, Pisces. I feel like there could be someone kind of obsessively watching. Right? This person could be trying to, could be wanting to move. There could be a lot of stress and anxiety. They're, they're, they're sitting back thinking about this because it could have a lot to do with money, surviving the daily hustle. Someone could be worried that they're not going to have enough money to move on. They're not going to have enough money to move, right? Because there is an issue with broke ass and fed up. Someone could want to get away from someone who they feel like just uses them, right? I don't know, Pisces. Let's put this shit with this goal. Again, everything is not going to resonate for everyone. Don't keep something that doesn't fit for you. Head in the clouds, masculine energy. I just wanted to see. So it's coming up as a masculine energy that's very stressed out. Or you're stressed out about him. Access granted. Someone does want access to someone here. They do. They do. Or something. They want access to something here. I feel like someone could definitely be fed up with feeling like they're not getting what they want, right? Someone could be fed up with dealing with the situation where they feel like all they do is give and give and they don't get anything back. They could be looking at you 
wanting to come towards you, ask, want access to you, Pisces. I don't know, but it where it goes. I have a masculine energy. See, it's a man sitting on this card here, looking out the window. As you can see, I don't know what's up with my camera today. It's not looking so great. I, I work on it later. See that? So like my baby might have touched it when I wasn't in the room. And there's also a man on this stalker card. The only feminine energy I've, I'm looking at here is acting cold. Because see, there's lipstick on those lips. And fed up. Doesn't want to hear or see anything. So it feels like the feminine energy could definitely be very unemotional, unattached, possibly tired of hearing something. But here's that boss daddy. So there's masculine energy in and out. Put yourself where you go in this. Okay? It's boss daddy, divine masculine. High anxiety. About granting access. Key. Someone could literally be looking to move, get a car because I'm seeing keys here. Let's see what the dusted off energy is about. Because this is picking yourself up and trying again, right? Dusting yourself off and trying again. In some way, shape, form, or fashion. It feels like this is what someone wants to do or is doing or having a hard time accomplishing. And this is why they're stressed out about it. Whether this is you. Pisces, some of you could definitely be trying to move. I don't know if you could be in a relationship already and you guys are trying to move. You're obsessed with moving. Plug, tune in, internet, connected. Someone could definitely be watching someone online or they're searching for answers online. Pressure cooker. The heat is on in this situation, though. The heat is on here. Give me one more for dusting off. Archangel Michael. Protection. Prevented from harm. Divine intervention. Karmic. Third party. Relationship. Lesson. Somebody could definitely be learning a third party. A karmic lesson here. For sure. Someone could definitely be learning. It. Like, it could be a situation dealing with a karmic relationship here. Put yourself where you go with it, Pisces, for sure. Somebody could be learning a lesson from that. Someone could be trying to get out of a third-party karmic situation. They could literally be looking online, tuned into the internet. They're, look, they're searching for something online or they're doing research in order to dust themselves off and try again. They have protection to do this. They're prevented from harm. There's divine intervention. So it could be someone like obsessed with getting out of something. Pisces, for others of you, I see somebody like obsessively thinking of you. I don't know if you physically moved on from this person or if you just moved on from this person, but this person has high anxiety. Their head's in the clouds. They're kind of keeping an eye out on you. If, if you have moved on, this person is watching you move on, but you're divinely protected here. You are. They're watching you though. They're watching you dust yourself off and move on. They could definitely be watching you online, no doubt about it, but you're protected. It's like they can't do anything. It's like I can't do anything, but watch you move on for sure. And that could be stressing someone out. I'm going to get a couple of more oracles, oracles for these messages, and then we're going to clarify with some tarot, okay? Bear with me, baby sharks. All right. Let's see what we got here at the bottom of the deck. One day. Someday, somewhere, another time. Ooh, we. So somebody is saying some, one day they will. Ooh. I can't get past someday somewhere mm. let's see what's on this stalker energy apology return forgiveness gift see someone could definitely have some regrets here someone could be stalking you wanting to apologize here i'm telling you pisces they could regret that you moved on and they could regret that they didn't make some move or some sort of physical change at some point in time because this person could have waited with their head up their ass or their head in the clouds about making some sort of move and pisces you could have decided that you got tired of the excuses and that you didn't want to give anything else to it got fed up and went on about your business. This person could definitely want to apologize for sure. There is someone that is obsessed with apologizing to you, Pisces. I just don't know if this person needs to move or if you moved away from this person. It could just simply be a Cancerian or Capricorn. Let's see what we have for here in the clouds here. Look, I shit y'all not. Y'all watched. Y'all watched. This says masculine energy. I hate the way my camera is showing my cards today. Looks a little fuzzy to me. I'm definitely going to clean the lens. I think the baby was touching this. Do you see this masculine energy, masculine energy? The cards are saying that this masculine energy also in these ropes and chains is having high anxiety, scared and panicked. And he has his head in the clouds deep in thought here. We're going to do some tarot to clarify baby sharks because I hear y'all. I hear y'all. I do. I show, I'm showing y'all what I'm looking at. It's possibly it's the same man that wants to make this apology here. Feminine energy is looking fed up like she's not giving something. She has nothing to give. Okay, let's see what we get for dusted off. 
heart fog, mixed signals, blocked emotions, cluttered. There's going to be some sort of divine intervention. Because there, there is someone who's having a hard time with something. Mixed emotions. Clutter just feels like to me like it could just be a lot. Like somebody's mind. Somebody could need to clear their mind. Someone could have a lot of shit going on. I don't know why I'm getting. Somebody could be living in a cluttered house with somebody and they can't wait to get out. Mm. I don't know why I'm hearing like hoarders. Someone could be living with a hoarder. Can't wait to leave a hoarder. That is so random, Pisces. That is not for all of you. Let's get some clarification on this with Tarot. Again, baby sharks, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share if I'm getting it right for you. I appreciate all of y'all. If you're interested in booking me, please email me. You guys do right by me, Pisces. Y'all are my MVPs. Let's go ahead and get some information on this stalker energy. Spirit, clarify the energy of this stalker. Someone is watching. Someone is stalking, watching, and obsessed. We're making some sort of apology. This person also may be focusing on moving or Pisces, you may have moved away from this person. There is something about a physical move or a change, a location change that's that's dealing with this Pisces. Just put it where it goes. Give me one for the stalker and the apology here. Who's feeling this way? Clarify this energy for Pisces. There we go. There we go. Justice. It could be a Libra. Could be a legal situation going on here, right? There could be something about a legal situation. Now I have the devil, I have justice, and I have Cancerian, and I, and I have uh, the chariot, right? So that's Cancer, Libra, Capricorn, and under here is the Page of Swords. There's definitely someone watching. Someone could definitely be, if someone could definitely, they're looking at something is wish fulfillment and they want to communicate. Someone could wish like hell that they could apologize or someone knows that they may have to tell someone, this could be, I'm sorry, I'm leaving for somebody. I don't know, Pisces, put it where it goes. Let's get one for what you all are waiting for here. Let's see. This is saying here, masculine energy on one card. I hate the way this camera is looking. And then I have. Ma masculine energy on another one okay this is divine masculine here masculine energy here the cards are telling me this masculine energy here has his head in the clouds and high anxiety there's there's a little fear and a little panic about something let's see if we can find out what it is my beautiful soul tribe give me some for head in the clouds masculine energy if the emperor come out i am too through <laughs> give me some for the head in the clouds Anxiety and mas uh, masculine energy here for Pisces. Clarify his energy. Death, an ending, a changing, tra transformation. It could be a Scorpio. Four of Cups is coming up as this, this masculine energy being very bored and discontent with something here. And Seven of Swords to the Wands. Also strategizing on how to get out of some sort of oppressive situation. There's a masculine energy here that's someone could be afraid to make this move. They could be obsessed. They could know they want to do it, but they're afraid to make this move. And it could definitely have something to do with the karmic relationship here. Pisces, you could have ended it with this person and they're strategizing here. Someone is definitely stressed out about an ending, about a change, about a transformation. Give me one more for this, for the head and the clouds and the masculine energy here for Pisces. Make it plain for me. Can you tell me more about what this masculine energy? The four of wands. So something is ending, changing, and transformation, transforming with a partnership, a union. Someone could be leaving their house. That you could have left this person. You could, you guys could have let live together or something here. There's something about an ending, changing, and a transformation to a partnership and a union, a long term one, Knight of Pentacles. And this man is stressed out about it. Hmm. So let's see what the dusted off energy is about. Whoever is picking themselves up and dusting themselves off has divine protection here. They do. If, and if this is something that someone needs to do, it's divine intervention, right? It's some sort of divine intervention that's going to come through, that's going to remove some clutter, that's going to clear up anything that someone has, is having mixed signals about, that's going to unblock someone's emotions here. So whoever, Pisces, whether you dusted yourself off and moved on from someone you did the right thing. They could be watching you on the internet. Or someone is knowing that they need to do this. They need to dust themselves off. They need to get in tune. They need to start looking and researching. Someone got me having mixed feelings about having to do this, but I see someone doing it. Just put it where it goes, baby sharks. Give me one on the dust it off energy. Who's doing this? Someone is dusting themselves off and trying them again here. The Knight of Cups. Someone could be coming in offering love to someone here. Look, there he is. The King of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Y'all, some of y'all definitely dealing with a Scorpio. <coughs> Cancer, Libra. 
<laughs> the Ace of Wands. It's coming up as very masculine doing this. King of Cups, Ace of Wands. It's coming up as a very masculine energy doing this. Pisces, maybe this is you. Maybe you're, you could be a feminine energy watching this. You could be doing this too. You could be in this very masculine energy. The King of Cups has deep emotions, but he does not always show them, right? So maybe you're doing this. Maybe you're getting in control of your emotions. You're dusting yourself off. You're moving forward. Or this masculine energy is doing this. They could be coming towards you. Just put it where it goes. Give me one more for the dusted off energies for Pisces. Give me one more for that. Queen of Cups. Ooh, we baby sharks. There you go. That's us. Ten of Cups. Happy home. Happy life. Peace and tranquility. There's an energy of that coming in, an offer of that coming in. Show Liz. And I'm going to show y'all something else. I have the Ten of Cups. Happy family. Happy life. Here's a King of Pentacles under there. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn coming up. Very masculine with the Ace of Cups. Okay. Someone is doing this. Someone is going after a whole new beginning. There's like new love, returning love, refreshed energy. I definitely feel like money and finances is a part of it with the King of Pentacles. But there's an offer. There's like dust yourself off and try it again because boom, it's like dust. Pick yourself up, dust yourself off. It's like divine intervention, divinely guided. It's protected to do this because someone is coming in here with a solid offer, a really good offer. But I see all the other stuff that's involved before we get there. Put yourself where you go in it, baby sharks. I love you guys. Please remember to take care of your girl with the likes, comments, subscribe, shares. you're interested in booking me, please email me. If you're interested in a $10 Etsy messages, click the link to my Etsy shop. Again, the turnaround time for those reads are about three days, okay? All right, guys. I love you guys. Continue to stay beautiful. Continue to stay, to stay blessed. Stay healthy and take care of yourselves and your families. I'll bring you messages soon. I will probably go later. Go live later. Bye, Pisces.